As the Kenya Revenue Authority struggles with meeting its revenue collection targets, it's emerging that the cause of its problems is in their system. The multi-agency team in an operation dubbed Linda Ushuru, unmasking what it terms an 80-man strong criminal enterprise comprising senior and middle-level managers at the domestic taxes and customs and border control departments, say to have colluded with taxpayers to avoid paying taxes. Though the period of tax evasion is not indicated, the DPP partly blames the vice for underperformance of projected revenues, saying, and I quote, the criminal scheme has over a period of time occasioned a reduction in tax collection, end of quote. Detectives are said to have stormed carry offices along Mombasa Road, let out members of the public seeking services before proceeding to call out the names of the suspects, arrested them while also recovering phones and other electronic gadgets. The operation was carried out in different parts of the country. More arrests expected as other co-conspirators are sought. 75 employees who have since been interdicted allegedly aided tax evasion by facilitating irregular clearance of cargo and executing fraudulent amendments of tax returns. The supplementary budget tabled in Parliament Thursday showed that from July 2018 to March 2019, 1.179 trillion shillings was collected against a target of 1.277 trillion, representing a shortfall of 97.7 billion. KRA last hit its target in the 2010-2011 financial year during the reign of retired President Mwai Kibaki. <laughs> The government continues to tighten its news on those linked to graft. Opposition leader Raila Odinga joining the chorus of those calling for sustained action. At the end of this process that we started with the Huru Kenyatta, there's going to be a new Kenya. Corruption has been fought. We need to be able to do this and this line and the DPP. We need to be able to do this and this line and the DPP. The suspects have been detained for questioning and statement recording before arraignment. Chemutai Goin, Citizen TV.